Caldwell County officials say their spike in COVID-19 cases is the result of an outbreak at a local nursing home facility. KXAN's Tahir Rahman reports the county's emergency management office is stepping up testing in partnership with the Texas Division of Emergency Management and the National Guard. So right now what you see behind me are uh, people that made appointments uh, to get tested. If you try to sign up for a COVID-19 test here in Caldwell County Tuesday, you may have gotten this message online or over the phone. We had uh, 200 appointments this morning and the phone line shut down because that's where that's where the limit was at. The county's emergency management chief says they just got approved for two more testing days in the county in partnership with the National Guard, which is also helping test nursing homes in the area. We had a total of five uh, nursing homes in Caldwell County tested. The county reported a spike in cases over the weekend due to results from those tests last week and says an outbreak was discovered at one facility in Luling. The county has not confirmed which home had the outbreak. But Magnolia Living and Rehabilitation says it had at least two cases of COVID-19, saying they are working with health officials to prevent its spread and cannot give us any more information about its confirmed cases. Where they are? Caldwell County says a disinfectant team from the National Guard was sent to decontaminate the nursing home experiencing the outbreak. Tahira Rahman, KXAN News. On Friday, Caldwell County reported 87 cases of COVID-19. On Monday, that jumped to 133. As of this afternoon, Caldwell County reports 158 confirmed cases of COVID-19. As of yesterday, there were more than 4,700 cases at 549 nursing homes all across Texas. We've been tracking all of the cases at local nursing homes. You can find that map on KXAN.com. Just make sure you click on the Investigates tab.